Pixmob uses infrared light to control the wristbands we distribute to the audience. So we have transmitters that look a bit like big TV remote controls that are controlled over DMX. So we put those transmitters in a, in a venue and then we have a light board that can send DMX commands to those transmitters and then those commands are converted into infrared light that we send to all of the wristbands. So that lets us do all sorts of effects, like having all the audience light up at the same time, do strobe effects, things like that. Typically the way it's done when, when you want to create those effects is you program each individual wristband with a specific command. So you can say that wristband at this specific time will turn red and the other one will turn blue, for example. And then you have people that distribute those wristbands in each individual seat before an event. So that lets us do all sorts of specialized effects. However, as you can imagine, it's a really lengthy process. So what we decided to do is, because we use infrared, we could try to paint infrared on top of the audience. So imagine having visible light that sweeps across the audience, but instead of visible light, we use infrared. What's great about that is you don't need to distribute or pre-program all the wristbands before a show. You just give them at the door, people go sit wherever they want, and then the moving heads will do the magic. The moving heads will send infrared commands just like our big transmitters do, but they can send it at specific locations at specific moments in time. So that's how we do the same wave of light with absolutely no pre-programming or no pre-positioning of all of the wristbands. That lets us do a really crazy specialized show in under a day of work and pre-programming. We've only started playing with this about a few months ago and we're ourselves really amazed at the types of effects we can do with the moving heads. And I'm really looking forward to see what other light designers will create with this.